There are monsters in this universe, and O-type stars are the worst. Just one look at this blue devil would burn your retinas to ashes. At this distance, you're being hit with 500,000 times Earth's UV index. Your ship isn't failing. It's turning into liquid stardust. Gravity here doesn't just kill you. It redesigns you. Your body becomes cosmic string theory in action. This isn't a surface. It's a nuclear hurricane. Each droplet here is hotter than the core of a hydrogen bomb. Your body is now a particle accelerator. Every atom you ever had is being remade into something alien. Einstein was right. Here, your last second could last forever. An eternity of burning. Ghost particles are tearing through you right now. The only thing left will be a faint neutrino signature. Your cosmic tombstone. This isn't re-entry. This is erasure. Layer by layer, you're being deleted from existence. That flash just released more energy than humanity has ever produced. And you're at ground zero. Now you understand stardust, because that's all you are now. Deep in its heart, a helium bomb just detonated with the force of a million suns. This is why O-stars live fast and die violently. You just became a meteor, and your impact crater will last all of 0.3 seconds before the star erases it. Your body isn't burning. It's being quantum disassembled. Every chemical bond you ever had just voted to quit. This star just wrapped you in a noose made of raw magnetism. The executioner won't need a second try. Even your light can't escape. These echoes are your only funeral, and the star is already forgetting them. Somewhere in the galaxy, a black hole just fired a particle rifle, and you're the bullseye. This isn't a wave. It's a continent of fire moving at Mach 100. Swimming lessons wouldn't help. Congratulations. You're now part of a star's chemical signature, the universe's most brutal recycling program. That tiny vibration? It's the sound of your mass being digested. The universe just burped. Your last light just got stretched into infinity. No one will ever see it. But it's still out there screaming. Your skeleton isn't melting. It's being nuclear sputtered. Each calcium atom is now shrapnel. The star just caught you in a 100 million degree lasso. Rodeo season is officially over. Even your light is sentenced to life imprisonment here. The ultimate dark tourism destination. You're not just dying. You're being promoted to star fuel. Employee of the month goes to your carbon. That beautiful pattern? It's the sound of your body mass disturbing a star. A deadly sonata. Your molecules are cheating physics to escape and still failing miserably. Briefly, you were the universe's most tragic candle. Then the stellar wind blew you out. Your iron content just became compass needles pointing to hell. This isn't death. It's becoming a nuclear physics classroom demonstration. Time itself is giving up on you. The clock won't just stop, it will flow backwards. Your chemical signature will last 0.3 seconds, longer than most relationships. These uncharged killers don't care about your hopes and dreams. Your particles are having the ultimate bad romance, matter and antimatter swan song. The star briefly wears your face as a mask, then forgets it forever. Even space-time bends to mock your demise with perfect optical precision. The universe's cruelest joke, fake messages from your vaporized corpse. You're being stellar poop toward the core, a 100,000-year journey to nowhere. Your electrons are forgetting how to electron. Existential crisis at the subatomic level. Your final scream will turn to a whisper, then to radio waves, then to nothing. These intergalactic bullets will be your only memorial. Your water molecules just became hydrogen bombs. Congratulations. Astronomers 1,000 light years away could theoretically detect your death in a millennium. For his points or so to one seconds, you were part of a stellar arm waving goodbye. This is what happens when physics gets claustrophobic. Light itself has weight here, enough to flatten your atoms into stellar wallpaper. Your particles are going out with a light show worthy of a supernova. This is how the universe strip mines atoms. Briefly, you were part of the star's exotic material experiments. You're not just in the star now. You're part of the fabric of reality itself. The ultimate surrender to chaos. Your atoms have joined the heat death party. This blue monster will die screaming, taking entire solar systems with it. Your atoms might survive to become part of something even stranger. A pulsar's crust. Your next stop. A 10 million year journey through the cosmic void. Maybe you'll be part of an alien world's mountain someday. Maybe. The universe's ultimate joke. Everything leads to the same dark ending. Somewhere, something might note this blip in stellar spectra. And move on. Your energy will continue until the universe runs down like an old clock. In Google years, random particles might briefly think they're you, then stop. 
unless somewhere some version of you made different choices. And in the grand scheme, this was less than a blink. Beautiful, isn't it?